guys welcome to my youtube channel and in today's video i'm going to show you how to configure a wi-fi repeater or um, wi-fi booster so normally we use it um, in the spot in our houses where we are not getting um, strong signals of our wi-fi let's say in my basement i'm gonna um, configure it for my basement so first of all let me show you guys it's a generic brand a Wi-Fi repeater like it's not a known brand uh, but they works normally uh, they are pretty good even if you got a generic one so always you will find a manual there Wi-Fi repeater manual and here is the Wi-Fi repeater the um, quality looks normal okay but it will work 100% I know that because I have experience with them and uh, in the box you'll see um, Ethernet cable as well so I'll keep the Ethernet cable on site for now because I'm gonna configure it uh, as a wireless repeater uh, with my main router so I'm gonna plug it in and we'll see after that now it's just turning on uh, you can see the red and green bulb um, I will uh, do a hard reset even if it's brand new but I'll give it a try and after resetting it uh, I'll start config I'll, I'll start configuring it okay so guys um, I have to reset this device uh, even if it's brand new I just want to be sure that uh, there is no settings already on the device so you see there is a there are like Wi-Fi uh, uh, light is green it means it's uh, sending the Wi-Fi signals I can find the signals on my phone but before that I want to reset the device you you should uh, looking for a small button like this and keep pressing it for five seconds and I'll show you how will it behave uh, yeah so you see that uh, the green light the second one on the top it's is just blink two times and it will be yeah that's it the Wi-Fi signals are, are off and now this one is on it will blink for two three minutes like two three seconds sorry and the device will be factory reset and after that uh, I'll show you what to do now I have to wait for the Wi-Fi signals back because this device will uh, start sending the signals again and we have to wait for that yeah it's already there so now when i got uh, the wi-fi signals uh, green then i have to go to my cell phone settings i'm using an android an iphone even if you're using an android doesn't matter uh, the settings uh, will be the same so now i can see wi-fi repeater here i have to click on that and it's an unsecured network it means there is no um, password on this one because i've just reset it right and it's brand new so it's connected but i'm not getting the signals because it's, it is not configured so when it is connected when you click on it and on your Wi-Fi sections you see uh, the name of this device it means it's already connected after that you have to go to your browser now I'm in my browser and you have to find an IP on uh, in the back side of your device that will be starting from 192 in my case it's 192.168.10.1 and in your case it will be different so yeah and 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 in the manual you can find the username and password for the this device like the default username and password in my case it's admin and admin you have to uh, just take care of the um capital and small when you're typing in it's small admin small admin the username and password yeah english and yeah okay when i click okay with admin and admin i'm getting this interface it means ap uh, access point repeater which one i want so i'll go for the repeater okay guys so when i click on repeater uh, you can see i'm getting all the available networks surrounding me and i have to select the one i uh, the one i want to extend uh, so i can select any um router or any extender you have already configured in your house which is closer to this one like the spot you want to put this one in you have to select the network in your house near to this router so uh, in my case i'll select my main router which is this one and now it's asking me the repeater ssid so 
don't forget to change the SSID of this one. Don't keep it the same for both. So I'll give a name ABC extend. Okay. And it's asking me the password. So uh, give any password. I'll give a S D F G H. Oh yeah. I just keep it simple. Like anyone, uh, any password, you know, which is easy for me. Yeah. So I already gave the password. Click apply. When you click apply, it's gonna configure itself automatically. And you will see that it will come up with a successful message. Uh, so it's done and close it you have to close the browser close this one go to the Wi-Fi uh, settings again and you will see uh, ABC extender is there right there you can see this is the one click on this one and it, it's asking me the password so I'll give my password and join when I join the network hey let's wait for it <laughs> it's just loading uh, you can see the Wi-Fi signals and it's done that's it it's uh, as simple as this so thank you so much for watching this video guys and please like it and subscribe to my channel and